What is up you guys? Today I'm bringing you a review of the M800 foldable grow light from 716LED.com. This grow light features a densely packed bar of LED lights um, ranging from 4000K to 660 nanometers. This light has Samsung diodes and Sosin drivers. There are two 400 watt drivers that come with this light. This light also features daisy chaining and is dimmable. So let's get right into the parts. test. We're set at about 12 inches from the ground. And let me just go over and set the light up to 100% and grab the photo bio by Phantom alright Turn that on real fast and we just want to get a center reading to start. Um, this is a great reading right here. We have 1700 micromole at 12 inches. Um, the 600 watt light I had shown previously would only go up to about 1400 at, at uh, 12 inches. So this is a great reading. Um, you definitely want to run CO2 at those uh, micromole. Um, if you want to get the, the light that close to your plants. Um, again, 12 inches. And we'll move it up to 16 and show you that. Okay guys, we're back. We have the light set to about 16 inches. I'm trying to get to show you, but the light in the background is so bright. Let me see. Uh, well, you just have to trust me. It's at 16 inches. Um, we're getting readings in the middle of about 1500 micromole. And uh, hopefully you can see that. 1500 micromole at the middle. Um, we're gonna move it around a bit. So we're gonna go to this front corner. Still a thousand micromole. You probably you probably wanna run CO2 with this lamp at 16 inches. Uh, again, good even coverage with the uh, eight bar design here. We have another showing right around that thousand micromole mark wherever I move it around to. Um, let's go around this side and see what kind of readings we get over here. Um, 1400, that's still right right around the middle of the uh, grow lamp. I'm gonna move it out to the sides. Wow, in a four by four tent, this thing is great. I'm getting readings of a thousand micromole. Um, the light is moving around a little bit because I'm moving around a little bit, but yeah, and in a, in a grow tent, a four by four grow tent, this grow light, I don't think you can beat it. Um, this 800 watt grow lamp is a great addition to any grow room. Uh, four by four up to six by six. Um, and really you could, depending on your crop, grow um, in a larger area with this lamp. It is 800 true watts. Let me show you that here. I'm bumping into stuff. I'm in my garage. Uh, 841 watts is the draw. And uh, yeah, it, it's doing great. I'm gonna show you the 24 inch test now. All right, so I got the light set to 24 inches. Really don't know if you guys can see the, the tape measure here. I'll try and focus on it for you. Yeah, well, it's at 24 inches. Um, let's grab the photo bio. It just turned off. And get a good middle reading. Um, even at 24 inches, we're still hitting 1100 par. Um, I could see in a 4x4 grow tent you having issues with... Uh, with light burn or a height a height issue with this lamp 
Um, because you can really only raise it, uh, really only raise it about like 20 inches above your plants. I mean, your, your plants are probably going to stand if you're doing hydro, um, about like two feet up anyways, like 16 or 18 inches up anyways. And, uh, let's move this around here. See what we get. 700 at the, at the far edges. And uh, let's do like middle, middle corners. You're getting 800. I mean, this is a great grow lamp. Um, but even even if you do have height issues with this lamp, it's dimmable. So say uh, say at 24 inches above your plant, you're getting light burn because you don't run CO2, and you know, 1100 par is just too much for your plants to handle. Well. You can come right over here to the dimming switch and just flip that bad boy to 50%. And look, um, it did drop the par about, you know, about 50% or even 25% if you're going like veg. Uh, let's see. 25%, you know, it dropped another half, so 300 par. Um, and obviously, you can move your light up or down as, as you like. Um, I like this lamp so far. It doesn't cause like any strobing effect with my uh, security system, and uh, I think that just has to do with the spectrum that is used. It's 4,000K white light and 660 nanometer uh, red light, so it does provide that sunlight sunlight spectrum for good flower growth and uh, good vegetative growth. All right, we're gonna raise this up to 36 inches and get a par reading of that. All right, so I got this about 36 inches above the par meter, and we have a reading of 800 micromole. Now, you're not gonna wanna run this light 36 inches above your plants at all times, um, obviously, so the, the dimming capability really comes in handy here. Like, um, if, like I just said, if, if your, if your plants are getting any heat stress, you can turn it down to 75, 50% and just, it'll be great for your plants. Um, let's see how even this coverage is. Uh, just one moment while I seal up the tent and, uh, we'll take a look around. So right in the middle of the tent again, and sorry about like the little plant matter and like some shipping stuff, but, um, we have a reading of 850 micromole. Uh, toward the front where there's not even any ref like reflectivity uh, because I have the door open We're still getting readings of 650 micromole. This light is amazing for the price um, Check it out at 716led.com. Let's head over to the corner here Oh, my photo bio just turned off again 700 micromole at the corner at 36 inches at 100% on the dial um, you're gonna grow great dense flowers. No need for CO2. Um, this this light is gonna perform amazing for you. Uh, you can do a far corner. I don't think there's gonna be much difference. So so like I said, in the middle, 800, 50 at the corners. Uh, let me get out of the tent. 700. There's like no reflectivity over here. Uh, side corner, 700. I'm getting in the tent now, so those pars are gonna drop down but uh far corner way way back corner because this light has such great coverage 750 micromole how are you going to beat this light it's it's just over 500 dollars for an 800 watt lamp that you can grow about two and a half or three pounds or more with a light like this i would really recommend you guys check this offer out um, they are having a sale on their website for the next three days, I believe. And yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm going to probably get another one of these lamps and throw it in my 8x4 tent. Or um, check out their 650 watts because this one might just be too much. Uh, too much power for the tent. Um, yeah, like I, I'm blown away by the, the, par, the par test of this light. I mean... It's a great looking lamp. Um, here, let me get in the tent. This is not good for my eyes, but here, let me get in the tent for you. Um, like, look at the density of those diodes. You're, you're, you're really not going to find 
a lamp that's this well made for this price anywhere. I don't care where you look, you're not going to find it. Um, so I just recommend 716LED.com for all your lighting needs. They What they do is they contact manufacturers of these lights. No, it's, it's just a great deal. Um, and you don't have to worry about contacting anyone overseas or is my light going to ship from China? No, they ship from the U.S. or Canada. I think this one actually came in from Canada. Um, but I'm in New York, so that only took like maybe an extra two days on top of what it, what's normal. Um, but yeah, as far as these numbers go, guys, like... I have to I have to raise this light <laughs> to 36 inches, dim it to uh, dim it to 50 percent. Hang on. Okay, so that's 100 percent. 850. So I'd have to dim it to 50 percent for veg. I mean, 50 or 75. And just to show you that um, at at 50 percent, it is you know pulling 50 percent. You know, 417 watts from the wall. Uh, it's a great lamp for the price. I really, I really do recommend 716LED.com. Um, Samsung diodes, uh, Sosun drivers, two, three year warranty. Um, so if anything goes wrong, you contact 716LED, they contact the manufacturer, and then um, you get your new parts or your new light. Um, it's really that simple. So yeah, again, 716LED.com. Oh, and by the way, by the way, this light is folding, which I really, I really like that feature. Um, it made it really easy to carry in here and set up. Uh, and yeah, it's just, it's just, it looks cool. I mean, um, we got these quick connect as well. Uh, again, dimming and you can daisy chain up to a hundred of these together, they say, with a controller. Um, I, I believe the controller is sold separately for like a hundred dollars, but um you can always figure that out uh if you're if you're growing that large of a of a crop um but yeah again again i recommend 716led.com for all your lighting needs and uh i think they're going to start adding other products as well so definitely check them out all right guys so see ya um we have another light review coming up pretty soon it's the 650 watt model next time uh so we can see how that, the, is it worth it to get the 800 watt or should you just go for, with the 650 watt for your 4x4 four four tent? Um, and I, I do recommend 4x4 four four tents. It's a little bit smaller than a 5x5, five five, but you're really only going to have four, four plants, you know, tops in each of those anyways, if you're growing them out the right way. Anyways, guys, have a good day. Um, I hope you really enjoyed this video.